Am I wrong for wearing my girlfriend's hoodie? Hi Reddit. I think I need some help here. My girlfriend and I went to my parents house last week for a visit. My brother, his wife and their son were also visiting. Sister-in-law and I have never gotten along. She kept my brother from coming to my 18th birthday party because I told her she couldn't bring her baby with her. It was a place full of drunk people and loud music. Not ideal for a baby. She also has issues with my sexuality, bisexual guy here, and my relationship with my girlfriend. Though she doesn't like it when I point out how dumb her logic is. Anyway, things were going good until I got a bit chilly. I'd forgotten to bring a jacket slash hoodie with me as it had been warm when we'd left. Thankfully, my girlfriend is almost always too warm and only wears hoodies cause she looks great in them. Her words not mine though she does look great in them. She offered me the hoodie, I put it on, and then all hell broke loose. Sister-in-law started lecturing me about how a real man would never wear his girlfriend's clothes, and, since I'm normal straight, now, then I should try and act more like a man. I don't see her issue with it. My girlfriend is taller than I'm so her already baggy hooders look slightly baggier on me cause of how short I am. My girlfriend says she thinks it's cute and I think her hoodies are comfortable. Plus it's not like it's all the time. Anyway, sister-in-law had her aunt about how it's gross and makes me less of a man and how it makes her uncomfortable. She made a few comments about how my nephew could be influenced by my behavior. Anyway, things were tense for a while after that, and we left a bit earlier than we'd originally planned to. So fast forward to yesterday, again we were all at my parents house and I decided, with my girlfriend's approval, to wear her bright pink school hoodie. I didn't go to the same school as my girlfriend and sister-in-law knows that. She recognized the hoodie and went quiet, shooting us dirty looks whenever she could, and making snarky comments every now and then. I later got a text from my brother that I made sister-in-law really uncomfortable, and that I'm a butthole for wearing something I knew would upset her. I know it was petty, but I'm a petty witch, and I kinda feel like she started it. Anyway, most of my family are on my side. But there are a few who think I'm a butthole for being petty, and that I should just let it go. So Reddit, am I wrong? Edit, thank you so much for the comments and advice. I have made an effort to read and upvote every comment, even if I haven't managed to respond. The kind words really mean a lot. Also, to those of you who mentioned wearing a skirt or something to the next gathering, my girlfriend actually loved this idea and picked out a pair of her boots, smaller heels so I don't break my neck, and a gorgeous pink sweater for me to wear. I'm not confident enough for skirts, yet. She also suggested makeup. Long story short, if we do go through with it, I may update. And now for the update. Hi Reddit. So I said in my original post that I might update and well, here it is. So this actually happened a week or two after my original post, but we've had a few unrelated family issues going on, and I haven't been able to post. Like a few of you suggested, I did wear my girlfriend's clothes at the next gathering. Nothing major, just some cute high heel boots, her pink sweater and a pair of her jeans. She also painted my nails a beautiful shade of pink and helped style my hair. Let's just say, by the end of it, I wasn't looking like a stereotypical manly man. Not that there's anything wrong with people that do like more masculine clothes. My girlfriend had also decided to wear jeans and a button-up shirt, just to annoy sister-in-law. Anyways, we went to my parents and immediately got glares and rude comments from sister-in-law. The comments started about how, if I want to be the woman in a relationship so bad then I should just go back to being a ref asterisk g etc. There were a bunch of comments before this, but she got annoyed when we ignored them in favor of having an intelligent conversation with other family members. That was the comment that really got to my parents though. It was partly the comment and partly the fact that my brother didn't do anything other than laugh. 
I've told them to stay out of it as my brother has a history of stopping their contact with my nephew over stupid things and they have enough to worry about. I'd been bullied a bit in the past for my sexuality and my brother never stood by me. To him it was my own fault. If I didn't want to be bullied then I should have stayed in the closet. My parents freaked out and all the anger and resentment towards my sister-in-law that they had built up for the past few years came pouring out. They told her how they really felt about her and how they are disgusted that my brother could allow someone to treat his own brother like crap point they told them to leave and sister-in-law is no longer welcome in their home until she apologizes. My brother tried the threat of preventing them from seeing their grandson. But they were done with him and threatened to get a lawyer involved. They now have scheduled visits, though now it's video calls as the rules are more tight again. I feel bad that they are no longer talking to my brother, but they've assured me that they'll be okay. Honestly this turned into my parents being badasses rather than myself or girlfriend doing much other than looking absolutely fabulous. Either way, I'm glad that we won't have to see her for a long while. We blocked her everywhere after this incident due to the angry messages slash voice emails we were getting. I know this probably isn't the update a lot of people were hoping for, but it's brought my family some peace of mind, and I'm happy with that. Did you like this video? If so, consider subscribing to Reddit Read It. We upload new videos and updates every day. Thank you for watching.